with that it's 77 and welcome back to my Ocarina of Time 3D so yeah in the last episode we were exploring the shadow temple and man I'm about to fall here but yeah we were exploring the shadow temple and we found the um, over books a new item that allow us to somehow float for a little time and it's great to get across of invisible paths and all that stuff invisible platforms or maybe even anything at all no ground at all but there's a problem as you can see there's no traction when you use them but yeah it's kinda cool so yeah we have the iron boots now we have the, also the other boots really great guys but anyway let's keep exploring the shadow temple and right now I'm using the lens of truth as you can see so it seems we have to get all these wrappings and there are two mummies here there's one there, one uh, another right there, okay? So yeah, let's try to kill those mummies right away. Here we go. Oh man, I didn't want to use. I I keep messing these buttons because I changed the layout of my items, you know? So yeah, I keep using the bombs when I want to use the uke shot. Yeah, I have to be more careful with that. But anyway, here we go, let's try to defeat this other mummy. There we go. And we get another treasure chest. Maybe we get a small key. We'll see, guys. There we go. Oh no, just wrappings. Okay, no problem. So, there's another the one right there. There we go. Oh, there's an invisible gravel here. You see? there yeah cuz you can use the eye of truth here you see there's an invisible platform and there's an invisible yeah okay so let me see what we got left we got this one and yeah that's it all right so we can now get to this door here there we go and let me see so Let's see if there's something. Yeah, there's the golden skull right here. Okay, fine. Oh, and there are bats around here, so be careful. There's one right there, and another one right there. Oh, come on, Link, do this. There we go. And the other one is right there. Let's just get it. Oh no, there are there are more than just one actually. That's it. We got all of them, I think. Yeah. And we open the door once again. And let me see. There are some flower bombs here, maybe we can throw one right there, inside that yeah we can, and we actually got a small key it seems yes we did it, we had a small key, so now we have this small key, I guess we'll be good to go and we'll be able to open that door right there and there's another thing we can grab with the hook shot right there yep so let's get it Alright, and let's open this door, guys. Okay, so now we're here, alright. Let's see, what we... Oh, there are some vents. So, be careful. I could actually use the iron boots to get through this. But you just need to time it right and you'll be able to go through. Oh, come on. Okay, so... Let me use the iron boots right away. There you go. Alright guys. Oh come on Link, get down there. Here we go. So there are more vents here. I guess that the best way to get through this is actually using the... Whoa, whoa, what is this? 
using the iron boots and let me see there's a passage there but anyway let me just check this before we keep moving all right and we got two other mummies here let me remove the iron boots all right there we go one less there we go we defeated both of them all right let me see if there are any treasures around here there's one right here okay and it's just a battle of arrows not really important anyway wait I, I'm seeing something right here on the map so let me just drop a bomb maybe it's nothing yeah it's nothing forget it guys yeah let's just keep moving for now so from what I get we have the passage right there we have the vents so I guess we'll have to use the hover boots and the vents to get through this passage okay I guess that's gonna be it let me use the eye of truth okay so let's see if I manage to do this alright come on yes so yeah you better use the vents to get through this like I did oh man okay no 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 come on Link get through this come on there we go okay we defeated one of them come on come on move 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 Link move there we go alright so we're done with those mummies and we obtained a treasure chest and we actually need another key for there we just got rupees but as I can see in the map there's still there's still a treasure around here it's gotta be hidden somewhere wait a second the the map tells me there's a treasures somewhere around here so maybe we can use a bomb here let me see guys and we can actually use one yes yeah, so you see there's a hidden treasure right under all this junk and everything so yeah you better use a bomb to remove all that stuff right there so you can get the treasure chest and that's it I guess we're done right here in this room we're done alright let's see what we got ahead wait a second so yeah there's this block I guess I have to get this block right here to get to the ladder but wait a second is there anything else around here hmm that's strange it seems to be something right there And I'm actually listening to the the sound of a golden skulltula. Yeah, I guess there's a golden skulltula right there, but I don't know how to get it. Hmm. Okay, I guess I'll have to check that out. But first of all, let me just get this block right under the ladder so we can get it. Alright, come on, Link. Here we go. <laughs> well that's a really tough work yeah it's taking yeah okay so we did it yeah it's taking a lot of time to push this block right here but yeah so let me see we got a boat here it seems yep but we have yeah there's a passage right there there's a golden skull to look at how do we get there and wait a second there's some kind of switch oh no no it's just some kind of jars or something but yeah there's is there any way to get through this maybe by using the ball or the boat I don't know and maybe you'll be able to get up there but that's a tricky one actually I don't know if you can do it let me just see if there's something useful in that in those jars here let me see so actually 
I'm gonna get an empty bottle here in case we find something useful, maybe a fairy, who knows. Oh yeah, we got a fairy. Okay. So we have a fairy right here. And, okay, let me just get the bombs back right here, okay. And let me see, hmm. Okay, so... Yeah, there's no passage around here. That's kind of strange, actually. No passage here either. Mm, so I don't know how we can get that skull It's gotta be in the boat or something. There's gotta be a way to get it. Anyway, here we go, guys. Let's get on the boat. And, yeah, let's see if we can do this. Hmm, wait a second, so we have the symbol of the Triforce right here, so I guess we'll have to play Zelda's Lullaby. Oh, we can actually get the Skullzilla from here. Nice, nice job guys, we did it. Great, okay, so I guess we're good to play Zelda's Lullaby. Okay, we did it. So I guess the boat will be moving now. Maybe. We'll see. And it seems so. Okay. Ho oh, ho! That's really spooky, actually. It's kind of... yeah. <laughs> okay, so... It seems like if this war was uh, the river of death, you know. Yeah, actually this whole temple is about death, it seems so. Yeah, well, it's called the Shadow Temple for a reason, right? <laughs> so, yeah, okay, here we go. There we go, okay. Oh, two of them? Yeah, so we got one. Whoa! Come on, come on. Oh. No, 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 man, no! Man, why? I didn't want to grab the ship. Oh, come on, we have to do all of this once again? Yeah, because of the, skull, uh, of the skeleton, uh, I was almost falling and Link grabbed the edge, and because of that, I missed the jump. I wanted to jump out of the, the ship. Yeah, but let's do it once again. Oh man, that's so annoying. But yeah, we're gonna do it. Alright, so here we go guys. Let's do this once again. But yeah, as I was selling this, uh, as I was saying, this wall um, temple, uh, it, it's around, um, yeah, it, it's all about this death, shadow, evil, you know, thing. So yeah, the, it's all this kind of dark environment attached to it, and yeah, it's really different from the previous ones, but anyway, let's get down with this, alright, come on, oh, you got me, no problem, I have three fairies, yeah, I'm kind of focusing in getting this done really quickly, but yeah, I'm kind of messing up. Yeah, I better use my shield. Come on, Link. Use your shield. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. There. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Finally, we made it. Okay, so we did it, and now the ship is gonna sink once again, I think, yes. So yeah, because of the last skeleton, uh, yeah, I, I died, 
and there was no reason to but yeah I died so whatever so let me see there's a statue over there there's another door right there there's some kind of platform right there and what is this can we there's some kind of passage here so I guess we'll have to get through this but the the overboots can't do all this distance so yeah there's gotta be something else we can find around here so okay let's see guys oh there are actually yeah this time it's real walls but we don't see them so it's the opposite that we were used to yeah but okay we're gonna do it and there are a lot of ants so be careful with that guys can actually get through here okay come on link whoa mm, it seems we can't kill them oh we can but not when they're glowing green so yeah don't try to kill them when they're glowing otherwise they'll get you so okay that's good to know Okay, just run away from them when they're green, and you should be fine. Oh, there's a wall around here, actually. Okay, so... There we go. We're done with them. Yes, we are. So there's a door right here. Let's check this one first. There we go. Oh, there's another hand right there. Okay, we got it. And it seems there's a treasure chest in this room. So, yeah, there's one right here popping up, but it seems there's another one hidden somewhere. Wait a second, so let me just get this one. Oh no, actually there's no other one, forget it guys. Yeah, that was the only one, yeah, forget it. Okay, so we got a treasure chest on this door, right here on this room, so let's see if we can get another one. Yeah, I'm kinda messing around here, cause, yeah, be careful, cause there are a lot of walls as you can see. But yeah, I'm trying to get this done without using the lens of truth. So this is another room, okay. And there's another golden skeleton right there. Here we go. There we go, guys. So we got another golden token. Okay. And now that we're done with that, let me see if there's something useful around here. Oh, there are more bombs. So yeah, we can use the bombs to destroy this stuff right here. There's got to be another small key or something. Okay, that's one. Forget it. It was about to blow up in my hand, so... Yes. And that should be the right one. Yes. Oh, we get a lot of rupees. Okay. So better get, maybe we, by killing this bat we get something, or maybe not, I don't know. Nope, actually there's nothing in this room guys, apart from the rapis. So yeah, if you want all the rapis, it's good to come here, otherwise there's nothing really important in this room. So okay, let's use the eyes of, the lens of truth once again, here we go. There's another room right here, and it seems we have two treasure chests in this one. Holy, oh wait, the wall is moving. Let me just get Dean's fire. Yeah, I better use Dean's fire because otherwise I guess I will die. Let me see if this can destroy the... Yeah, you can actually destroy the barriers since they're made of wood. Yeah, you, so you actually need Dean's fire for this dungeon. And there's the boss key. Okay, so... Let's get the boss key right away. Let 
Yeah, we got it. Okay. And I guess that there's something else here. Let's see what it is. What is it? So it's just it's just more five rupees. So not really interesting. But anyway, it's good to get it. some extra money. And there we go, guys. So let's use the lens of truth once again and get out of this. And yeah, we still have to figure out uh, how we can do that. How we can get across this path. There's gotta be something. Oh, I see. I see it, guys. I see it. Right there, you see? All those flower bombs. Yeah, there are a lot of flower bombs right there. Let me see if we can activate them like that. Otherwise, I just use the... Maybe we could use another bomb. Okay, so if I can't use it like that, I'm just gonna use my fire, fire arrows. Yeah, right there. So I have the fire arrows now equipped. And that should do it. Alright. So we got a new passage, guys. Okay, we did it. So we can get through this now. Okay. And let's see if there's something hidden around here. Okay, so... Navi is kinda glowing green once again so I'm gonna use the um, song of time because maybe there's something useful around here at least we'll, we'll see about it okay so let's see if there's any block or something and yeah there is okay we can get all this art and there's still another platform right there Maybe we can use it, maybe we can use the Song of Time once again, we'll see about it. Okay, so let's see if there's something else popping up. So the platform just disappeared from there. No, actually nothing happened. So yeah, I don't know how to get across, across this way, no, I don't know guys. But no problem, I guess we good to go now. Okay, so let's use a small key here. And the next room should be... Should lead us to the... Yeah. You see, there's a boss key right there. The boss key hole, the boss door. So yeah, the boss is gonna be right after this, guys. Mm, it seems we'll have to use the over boots to get through this. So let me just equip them. Okay, so... Okay. Here goes nothing. Let's do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. Let's get there. Come on, come on, come on, Link. There we go. And we did it, guys. Finally, we made it to... The door of the boss, so right here in the next room we're gonna fight the boss, guys. Are you ready? Let's do this. Alright. Let's see what the boss is this time around. And... Yep, I guess we have to fall right here. Yep. So let's do it. Okay, we go, guys. Phantom Channel Beast, Bongo Bongo. So I guess that's the evil spirit that's traveling all Kakuriko village and all that stuff. So now that I think about it, maybe I should use the 
iron boots here? No, the iron boots don't do a thing at all. And I'm using the... Yeah, so... Yeah, the iron boots aren't the best choice, it seems, so don't use them. Okay, so let's just remove the iron boots. Maybe the... The... Maybe the over boots do something, or maybe they don't. Oh, oh come on. Oh man, I'm gonna die right here. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to, oh, how to defeat this boss. But as you can see, the Eye of Truth, the Lens of Truth, allow us to see the real form of the boss right there. Oh, come on, Link. Come on, come on. So yeah, actually you can use this, the hook shot to get this done with, but I'm pretty sure you can also do it with the arrows. There we go. So as soon as you get him, try to hit the eye. Okay, there we go. So maybe the iron boots can be helpful, but not much actually, but they do. So I guess I'm gonna use them once again, maybe. Because even if you still jump with the iron boots, it seems you don't jump that much. Oh, come on, Link. You can avoid that. Oh, man, come on, come on, come on, come on, there we go. Oh... This isn't... Do I'm not doing too well in this fight. Yeah, let's just use the iron boots. I guess it's a better choice after all. Because, yeah, I'm kind of messing up this. Come on, come on, Link. Finally, we did it. There we go. Oh, come on, the camera is kind of messing me up right here. There we go. We're almost done, I think, guys. We're almost done now. Yeah, we did it. Okay, come on, come on. Oh man, he killed me once again. Hopefully I got fairies. But yeah, I'm really messing up in this fight. We have to be a lot, uh, doing a lot of tasks at the same time, you see. Oh, come on, and the camera is not helping at all. Oh, come on, Link, come on. Yeah, this will this fight will be a lot e easier if I wasn't playing in a flat surface, you know, because I'm recording and I can't use the the 3ds itself to to play with the camera. Finally, we did it. We defeated Bongo Bongo. That was really a tricky fight, man. Come on. You 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 solved those things we had to do at the same time? Yeah, really tricky. But yeah, we managed to do it, and I'm pretty fine with that. Oh, man. That was a really hard boss fight. But it was fun, but kind of tricky at the same time, you know. So, I guess we're gonna get another art container. 
And there we go, guys. So yeah, I spent all my fairies, actually. That was a lot of stuff to do. I don't actually know if we had to do use the iron boots or not. I don't get it. And we here we are in the chamber of the sages. And I guess we're gonna find Impa. Yes, we are. She's the sage of shadow, it seems. The boy with the noble Zelda's ocarina. As I expected, you have come. I am Impa, one of the Cheka. I am Princess Zelda's caretaker, and I am also the sage who guards the Shadow Temple. We Cheka have served the royalty of Hyrule from generation to generation as attendants. However, on that day, seven years ago, Ganondorf suddenly attacked and Hyrule Castle surrendered after a short time. Ganondorf Stergat was one of the keys of the Sacred Realm, the hidden treasure of the royal family, the Ocarina of Time. My duty bound me to take Zelda out of Ganondorf's reach. When last I saw you, as we made our escape from the castle, you were just a lad. Now I see that you have become a fine hero. There's nothing to worry about, the princess is safe now. Soon you'll meet Princess Zelda face to face, and she will explain everything. That is when we, the Six Chasers, will seal up the Evil King and return peace to Hyrule. Hmm, oh, right. I have to stay here. You, go to Princess Zelda's side and protect her on my behalf. Now I put my power, which shall be helpful to you, into this medallion. And that's it guys, we received the Shadow Medallion! Impa awakens as a sage and adds her power to yours! Alright, we did it! Please, look out for the princess! Okay, will do! And we're out of the Shadow Temple, we're back in the graveyard guys! We did it! Oh man, that was really tough actually! Yeah, so, let's just keep moving now, and actually, we have a lot of stuff to get from the Ass of Skulltula, well, at least I hope so, because let me see, we have like what, 42 golden tokens, that's a lot of stuff, so yeah, I'm gonna be exploring Kakiroko village, try to get something from the Skulltulas right there, and maybe I'm gonna buy some elf potions, cause yeah, I don't have any fairies right now, and I'm guessing the the elf potions, yeah, it's gonna be a good thing to get right now. So actually, there's this fella, there's this one, there's an, there's two more. So yeah, we got two more guys here. Here we go. You got Bumshu. Actually, if I recall, I already talked to this guy, didn't I? And he gave me the big wallet. Yeah, so we had an adult wallet from this one, the Chat of Agony from that one. Uh, we got a bomb shoes here, and we got the big wallet from this one. So, what do we have left? So we have one other left. Yeah, it seems we are, uh, only have one other Skulltula left. And maybe the big one also, we have to save it. But yeah. So we have bomb shoes. And uh, uh, they're, I'm pretty sure they're gonna be useful for something. Actually, if I remember, we could use them back in some kind of mini game when we are Child Link in the Iron um, Town Market. But yeah, let's just grab at least a red potion. Cause I guess we may be able to s get. I don't know, maybe some other fairies in our way. So yeah, let's just grab a red potion. And, yeah, maybe I'm gonna grab two, because I have a lot of money, so yeah. 
I have a lot of rupees, so just get another one, yeah. We never know. Okay, so no, that's that's it for now, guys. And yeah, I guess that's it for this episode. In the next one, we'll start exploring a new area. As it seems, it's gonna be like the Gerudo Fortress or something. Let me just shake here what the map says. Gerudo Valley and Gerudo's Fortress. So yeah, we have still two areas to visit in the map. Yeah, we have two areas blinking. And I guess that's where we're going next, guys. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like it. You can always add it to your favorites. Leave me your comments in the comment section below. Tell me what do you think about this boss fight. I know I didn't do that well, but it was kind of tricky, wasn't it? What do you think about it? And yeah, uh, you can also subscribe to my channel if you didn't already, and follow me on Twitter and like me on Facebook. All the descriptions are going to be in the um, all the links. I mean, sorry, all the links are going to be in the description. So yeah, that's it for this episode, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.